welcome to Kronos. This video is for full-time and part-time hourly. Please locate and click on the Kronos icon on your desktop. If you do not have a Kronos icon, please use the following web address, https colon forward slash forward slash Columbus K12 dot Kronos dot net. Please notice that your new username and password is the same username and password that you use to log into your email and computer. If you forget your username or password, you will need to contact the help desk at 8425. Let's get started. When logging into Kronos, you'll notice that your time card automatically pops up. Here is where you will enter the number of hours in the appropriate date column across from the appropriate pay code, then click on save. For example, today I worked four hours. I'll enter four under hours worked and hit save. Notice that after I hit save, it now calculates down under the daily total as well as the totals column. For other non-worked hours, enter the amount in the appropriate date column across from the appropriate pay code. For example, four hours of an absence that is unpaid is now going to be recorded under tomorrow. I say I won't be here, so I'm gonna put myself in as absent unpaid for four hours and hit save. Notice that the four hours calculates down at the bottom under the daily and I get a cumulative under the totals column as well. For pay codes not listed such as family illness, click on the enter pay code and pick from the drop down list. For example, death and family, FMLA, or family illness, those are all listed here as well. If you need to change the pay periods, you can do so by clicking the drop down arrow in the upper right hand corner. This is the current pay period. Let's go to previous so you can view what a completed time card may look like. For completed time card will look something like this. To maximize for your best view you can do so by clicking on the maximize and here you can view the full time card here you can see my hours worked my absence i also had an iep that i did on friday the 15th it'll give you at the end of each week your cumulative hours once a time card is approved it will be yellow and once it's approved, you no longer can make changes unless the approver who approved the time card removes the approval. That is all for Kronos. Thank you.